Will you sit next to me on the bus, Maria? Of course! I like sitting next to my friends on the bus. I sat next to Chris yesterday, and we pretended to be animals together. <laughs> what kind of animals? We pretended to be alligators and tigers. <laughs> and hippopotamuses. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Can we pretend to be animals on the bus today, too? Sure, Peter. But we have to remember to stay seated while we're on the bus. It's not safe to get up while the bus is moving. How do you know that? Let me tell you about what happened on the bus yesterday. Chris and I were looking at Chris's book about tigers. <laughs> it was so cool. It had pictures of orange tigers and white tigers. Then, out of nowhere, we went over a bump. We dropped the book and it landed far away. Don't worry, I'll get it, I said. Wait, Chris said. You should stay seated until the bus driver says that it is okay to stand, he told me. But I'm going to get your book, I said. Then we went over another bump. And I fell back into my seat. Are you okay? Chris asked. Yes, I said. But you're right. It's safer to stay seated when I'm on the bus. We can get the book when we get there. And when the bus driver says it is okay to stand. It was a good thing I decided to stay seated on the bus. Because we went over five more bumps. But we had fun staying seated. We pretended to be tigers until we got there. <laughs> well, you're right, Maria. It is safer to stay seated on the bus. But can we still pretend to be sitting animals? Of course. I'm going to be a bird sitting on someone's shoulder. <laughs> and I'm going to be a cat sitting on a fence. Meow, meow. And I'm hungry for a bird. Oh, no! 